On match day 34, Mainz and Hamburg's clash is a battle royale. Mainz are gunning for a place in Europe, while Hamburg will do anything to be in the relegation playoff. In December, their meeting set the tone with a drama-filled encounter that went up to the final kick of the game. Hamburg were hovering in mid-table and wanted to finish 2013 with a win. And they started well. Rising star Hakan Chananolu struck his fifth goal of the season to give the home side a vital lead. So going into the break, HSV held a slender advantage. But just two minutes after the restart, Mainz and their Japanese superstar Shinji Okazaki hit back. Through the season, the Imtech Arena has been a pressure cooker for Hamburg coaches, and Bert van Marwijk was feeling the heat. A quick-fire blast of goals raised the temperature even further. Nikolai Müller put the visitors ahead. Mites were showing the kind of form that would eventually lead them to be contenders for Europe. The task would certainly get harder for van Marwijk and co. Thomas Rincon saw yellow for handball, a warning of what was to come. HSV needed a hero, and they got one in the form of their biggest star. The captain, Raphael van der Vaart, bundled the ball home. Hope was there again for Hamburg. To all, with 15 minutes still to play. But as so often this season, Hamburg shot themselves in the foot and when Rincon took out Okazaki, it was clear the host would have to play out the remaining eight minutes with just ten men. That was just the invitation Mainz needed. Deep in injury time and with the last attack of the match, Mainz landed the knockout blow. Okazaki in the 92nd minute. A vital point for Hamburg dropped and two more for Mainz gained. It was practically the last kick of the match. Despair for Hamburg and joy for Mainz. If the same thing happens again on match day 34, Mainz will be in Europe. And Hamburg, the only ever present Bundesliga club, it doesn't even bear thinking about.